Ding dang darn it, I am grounded, and today is Super Bowl Sunday. I want to watch the Super Bowl, but I can't because I am grounded. What am I going to do? Wait a minute, I know. I will call somebody to drop bombs at the Super Bowl. Before I call anyone, though, I may want to use a code name so the FBI doesn't track me down. I also don't want people to recognize my voice, so I'll have to sound different. Hello? Who is this? Hello, this is Cold Loin Null. I have the perfect idea for you. Just to be clear, your name is Cold Loin Null, correct? Yes, you are correct. Remember that now. My name is Cold Loin Null, and nothing else. The idea I have is, I want you to drop a few smoke bombs on top of the stadium where the NFL is playing the Super Bowl. Understood? Understood. I will drop smoke bombs at the Super Bowl. Good. If you need any further assistance, call 555. Okay, got it. I will call you if I need any further clarification. I'll see you when I watch the game on TV. Okay, I've done my job. Now to wait until he actually drops the bombs at the Super Bowl. Ha 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 soy 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 raffle 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 raffle. Okay, I am now above the stadium. Now all I have to do is drop the bombs. Yes. Go Chiefs. You can win this game. I know you have it in you. Wait a minute, what's going on now? You've got to be kidding me. It looks like somebody just dropped a lot of smoke bombs all over the stadium. And maybe even a real bomb. Breaking news. This is Catherine Mulligan. Reporting to you live, the person who bombed the Super Bowl earlier today has been identified, tracked down, and caught. So, tell us now. Why did you drop bombs at the Super Bowl today? Because I was obeying an order given to me. The person who told me to drop the bombs told me his name is Cold Lionel. Could you repeat that? His name is Cold Lionel. I also have a recording of his voice of evidence. Yes, you are correct. Remember that now. My name is Cold Loin Null, and nothing else. The idea I have is, I want you to drop a few smoke bombs on top of the stadium where the NFL is playing the Super Bowl. Understood? Do you believe me? I showed you the evidence. Yes, I believe you. Now, regardless, you are still under arrest. We are going to track down that guy named Cold Loin Null that you speak of. And he will be arrested, too. Did you hear that, folks? This guy claims to be working for another guy named Cold Loin Null, and the police are going to try and figure out who that may be. Oh my goodness, that explains everything. Wait a second, did he say the other guy's name is Cold Loin Null? Todd, that sounds like a code name. We must decipher it as soon as possible. Let's investigate this now. I think I have a hot idea coming on right now. Father, we have figured everything out. We know who Cold Loin Null is, and you are not going to believe it. Really? Who has Cold Loin Null been this whole time? Allow us to demonstrate. This is how we saw that person's name spelled out in the closed captioning of the television broadcast. Naturally, this name resembles a code name. A common method of creating a code name is by making an anagram. This name appears to be an anagram. Look at what happens when you rearrange the letters in Cold Loin Null. What the heck? I cannot believe my eyes. That's it. Your brother is in so much trouble right now. Oh no. 
home. The cops are here. I need to answer the door right now. Yes, officer? What is it? Well, we have finally figured out who Cold Loin Null is. It's a code name, and we also found out that it is an anagram. When you rearrange the letters in Cold Loin Null, guess what happens? The letters in Cold Loin Null can be rearranged to spell out Lincoln loud. Could you please bring him here right now? He is under arrest. Lincoln, get over here right now. Yes, what is it? Loud, you are under arrest. We have identified you as Cold Loin Null. Don't try to prove us wrong. We know that you were using a fake voice over that phone call. But. 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 No buts. That is enough out of you. You're coming with us. No 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 no. Oh uh, oh Lincoln Marie allowed. How dare you call somebody and tell them to drop bombs at the Super Bowl. That's it. Once your prison sentence ends, you're grounded 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 for 270 more years. As soon as you get out of jail, go to your room immediately. No 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 no.